Uh, who did you want to jump on? You said Toy? You're going to stick on board yeah. with Toy? Alright, so we're going to go ahead and jump on board with Toy Soldier. This guy's going right inside into this uh, lower level of the mansion right now. I'm going to see if he can try to secure the uh, midpoint with these nades. Usually what you try to do, Waldo, is try to hold it down right here. Uh, try to see if you can grab those nades as they just did. And it looks like they got a good position right now with this uh, with this mid part. Immortal gets a good kill on there. Cubano's going to down Icy. Going to hop on cam with him real quick. Cubano's playing on boom shot, which is a good thing. He's in a really good position on Hot Tub. He sees the cross. He's looking up. He's going to get his shots off. This, whoever they're pinching right now is hurt. Back, dispense goes down. Cubano gets the kill. Watching him rotate around. Shit. One left. 3v1 situation. Oh. Toy Soldier gets taken out by Void. Nice round. And that was really good by... It was really good by Justice. They did a really good job of locking down the map and making sure that the boom shot didn't get picked up. Uh, Vex favored on grenades there. Uh, Toy probably could have been a little bit more aggressive. He came through the front door and met up with Dispense, but they didn't end up running around. Uh, let's hop on Cubano, who's running out of the front spawn here. Uh, he's going to be going in, going to be trying to take the lead. I'm going to see where he's going to play up on it. Looks like he's playing on back sandbags across from H. We're going to see what he's doing. And he it looks like there are two people on grenades. Ooh, Cubano's hit with a good shot of yeah. recovery. Yeah, Cubano right now a little hurt. Does recover. Taking shots. Does come a little red. He's really hurt. Ooh, all will aimless escape. Cubano is down by dispense. Looks like Vex. Phobia picks up that kill right now. I'm on board with Phobia. He's in this mid area. Gonna see if he's in the battle right now. Does down Void. Picks up that nice kill. Vex in control. Able to pick up that round right there. Looking solid. All tied 1-1. Uh, pretty pretty good overall, Waldo. You know, these guys are coming here to play. Like, again, it's just a show match. So it's basically like a scrim. doesn't really mean much. But these guys are out here playing for real. Who did you want to jump on board with? Uh, Dispensa has actually been going on. So let's watch him. They actually did a really good cross up on the high side. Uh, they're actually taking grenades on map control, which is something that you don't see in this. They're going to watch the cross over the middle. Red Icy crossing from the middle. <laughs> Looks like Justice got boom shot. Double ended up. Great shots nice. going across. Looks like Void is pushing up with Cubano. Looks like Void just got taken down. Mortal gets icy, gets down by Phobia. Oh my gosh, Phobia gets another one. Yeah, Dispense up here. Uh, Dispense did a great job up there uh, holding down that nade area. Uh, did get hurt a little bit, able to recover, picked up a nice kill. So uh, I, I I give uh, you know I give credit to Dispense on that uh, on that round right there. We're able to pick up the round four vex now up two to one. Waldo, I'm gonna check out Justice on this side. See what Cubano's got in mind. He's rushing into this mid area straight into the middle. He's looking for a great battle right away and uh, just taking some shots through the back. Unfortunately, does get down by Phobia, and then uh, uh, Justice able to pick up Boom. So right now they are in control with that Boom shot. Mens gets a big kill. Immortal downs Phobia. Oh my goodness. Toy Soldier recovers. Picks up Void there on that Ooh. map. Right now, Cubano in a nice battle with Dispense. Toy Soldier clutching the round, doing a great job there. And that is something that we did not talk about. Cubano did a really good aggressive push and he got up front and they baited the re they baited the kill with Icy and got killed by the boom shot. By Toy went around using that front door around the backside of grenades. If you don't play that position, you're gonna get caught. And that's exactly what happened. Toy took advantage of that, cut around, and ended up flanking the entire Justice Squad. Yeah, and uh, I, I jumped on Justice there on that last round. I'm checking out Vex. Phobia pushing this backside with the Lancer. Taking some shots. This is kind of the, the way that you want to go. Is You want to you want to start off with the Lancer on this backside. Down some people before you actually make that initial rush. Oh my goodness. Does get chunked by Immortal there. As he pushed from that midsection. Immortal in a gunfight. Wow. Boy, the great play. He's running the same thing. And Justice is just playing outside Boomshot. They're not wow. sending anybody to the front door. And that's a huge problem on this map. Because they cut that distance. Uh... Vex the entire round was stacking on top of grenades, taking power of grenades, taking control of it, and Justice was just pushing in a little bit too hard there, uh, and actually got absolutely shut down on it. Uh, big thing people don't talk about in Gears is map control, and especially when you're only fighting on 20% of the map and you give up the 60 on grenades, which is high side control and like four different crosses, you are not getting out of that. There's nothing that you can do to like really dodge out. If you're not playing grenades and trying to fight that position, that dude who's ever up on grenades is going to cross you out. And they're and the pistol's still very strong on this. So that has to be taken into account. I hope that Justice realizes the mistake there. They played a couple of really good rounds, had some decent strats, but they were not aggressive on grenade position, which led to those rounds happening. Yep. Boom is great, but 
doesn't do anything if half your team's dead before you can pick it up. <laughs> What's going on there, guys, in the chat right now? If you're just tuning in, uh, Vex took that first map for one. Seemed what quite easily. Uh, they controlled that boom area fairly nice. Uh, picked up some nice kills there and able to make some big plays. Vex right now in that 1-0 lead. Uh, as we're jumping into the second map, through all old school maps, guys, all old school maps. This is our first ever Gears of War show match already at 104 viewers. Appreciate the new follows. Keep hitting that follow button. If you want to get your squad on here, make sure you're going to the website and signing up, pa-gaming.net. You could be seeing Waldo coming up here casting. We've got some other guys that have been applying to come up here to cast as well. You're going to be seeing a lot of Gears faces, a lot of great casters coming this way. So make sure you're not only signing up your team, but if you're interested in casting, you're letting us know as well. As the giveaway coming your way at 200 viewers, Razor, Goliath, Mousepad right there on your screen waldo my man that was pretty intense that had me kind of kind of sweating there i mean that's what i miss about gears you know these straight up close action battles like you even mentioned it before uh we went live you're like these guys aren't going to go inside they're going to go straight outside shotgun nade battle all the way and that's exactly what happened but vex just a little bit more powerful there uh on that first map what'd you think yeah, and we're right back in. They're actually headed in on canals here nice. if we didn't see it. And they're going to end up fighting on mid-bridge right now. And Justice is taking control of it. Good job by then. Mets gets one-shotted by Dispensa. Gets taken out. And they've got him pinched on mid-bridge. Dispensa gets one, gets two. He's got a three-piece. Gets shut down by wow. Immortal. Immortal's going to be stuck in a 2v1. And he's going to get down by Phobia. Vex is going to take the round. And like I said, this is going to be another thing. Uh, a lot of the Gears 1's maps will choke on the middle point where grenades are because it leads to map control. It leads to the middle hallways, it leads to the connectors. You really want to make sure that you're fighting on that. We're going to hop on Dispense's camera right now because he's been putting up big numbers. Got a three-piece that last round. And he came up a little late, got a good shot on Mets, got the down. He's going to pop out his smoke, laying a good lance across. Looks like Justice has decided to pick up the snipe and torque bow. They're trying to push up on mid bridge. Dispense is holding position. Not really getting anything down. Oh, gets a good cross oh, on Kibata. Yeah. He's gonna get down. He's gonna push across. Gets another one down. Fire in the hole. Dispense gets one. Oh, and Toy Soldier takes out Dispense with a grenade. It's a 3v3 right now. Gonna see what happens. Looks like Justice is sitting up in the uh, back hallway with one connectors with a long shot. Boy pushing up. Woo! The soldier gets one. Woo! Gonna see how the shots are missing. Good strays. He is four. Wow. Hit. Immortal gets phobia. Boyd picks up the kill. 3v1 situation. We're gonna watch as they push up high side connectors. Gonna go and try to pick up Icy, who has the long shot in his hand. Pretty decent player. Gonna watch and see what he does. The best thing to do right now, just from the perspective of the caster, is they need to pinch him on both sides to make him pick a spot. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Well, I mean, that's yeah. Basically, it's it's only one, it's only one guy left uh, against three of them. I mean, he's got the snipe, so you kind of want to be careful. You know, it, it, with the snipe in this game, it's so easy now. Uh, all you got to do is really just get their head right in that ridicule. It looks like Cubano does down him for the last kill. Justice able to pick up that round there, Waldo. But I was saying, uh, if you're the last guy left and you got that snipe, two or three guys left, I think you're still okay if you know how to use that snipe. You can down a couple guys, make your way to nades, pick up some nades, you know, throw some nades in there and make it more of a game. Didn't work out there for him, unfortunately. Who'd you want to jump on board with this round? Um, you know, let's jump up on with Void this round, see what Void's going to do. Uh, the one thing that they miss them, they are no more active downs in this game, guys. Uh, so it's really just... Icy got hit by a good hard shot from the middle bridge. Yep. Looks like Void is in connectors. He's got a 2v1. He's holding the position up. Icy downs Kibana on the other side of the map. Nice. Void gets down on Toy Soldier. They're just is going to push up aggressively. Void gets down. Trying to watch what happens. Ooh! Phobia gets Ooh! a double there. Phobia picking up two big kills there as he does down Void there for that nice kill in mid area. Pushing this last guy. For the kill, easily make things work there for Vex. Very nice job there uh, by Phobia Dispense, making those plays, pushing that mid area and picking up that last kill. Right now, Vex currently up 2 1. We're on Canals, Gears of War, our first show match, guys. Tweet out that stream, Waldo and myself doing the casting. I'm going to go ahead and jump on board with Immortal uh, Waldo as he's pushing this mid canal area into this boat. Looking like they're going to see if they can grab this torque bow. And uh, without problem, they just push right through these yeah, guys. The yeah. Great job. They caught the Spencer out of position. 
great play by them. But it looks like Icy is down Ment, and it looks like Toy Soldier is down to Mortal. I don't know if they're still up. Nades are going off over the wall. Good little trick, Nade. Yeah, Toy Soldier. Here exploded. Looks like Immortal is still down, and, and he looks like he's going to get picked up. He's, I think he's on his last down. He is full red right now, trying to dodge around, get in position. Nobody, only Dispense has died right now. It was a good flank by Justice, undercutting the bridge. Good old school push. Creating pressure on the other side of the map. Uh, I'm going to search through. Mentz has long shot right now. Looking down connectors. He's going to try to get the shot. Trying to do a sneaky little right hand. Mm -hmm. uh, doesn't look like he's going to hit it. Void has Torque Bow, and they're running into a flank. They go all stacked up. Woo! Great Torque there by Void. Watching it. Ooh, almost got Icy there. Yeah, Void doing a good job with this Torque Bow right now. Able to work with it, throwing it at the ground, seeing if he can get this guy extremely red, and then try to push him with his shotgun. Takes a little bit of a different route. Push, miss, pushes back into their canal area. I'm on Void right now, ladies and gentlemen. Gets out the shotgun. Ooh. Nice shot to pick up Toy there. And right now, they're in a good position here to pick up this round. And good job by Cubano flanking him. There's actually a trick on this map that most people don't know. If you can actually get the grenades off the start, you can actually hit the bridge pretty dead center uh, and actually kill the guy sniping. It's a really risky play if you can do it, but you do have the ability to do it. And they did increase the nade range uh, back to what it was in Gal 1, where you can make some really good Kobe Hill Marys on, on the other side of the map. Uh, we're going to hop on camera... I'm gonna try to get the Spencer right now. Looks like he's having a Lancer battle down low with what I think is Cubano. Yep. Both teams have long shot, fighting and setting up. They're gonna try to play for mid bridge. Looks like Toy Soldier down Mentz in the back hallway. Gonna rotate over to him. Toy Soldier picks up the kill. He's full red. He's on mid bridge. He's gonna pick up grenades. Slip for him. Yeah, he's picking up big shots right now uh, from Choke Void with that Lancer. Second for one's gonna hit. Yeah. Ooh. Ooh. Very good dodge on that grenade there. I think that was Void. Yep, Void's doing a great job dodging up there. Uh, had his Lancer pulled out for the most part, uh, then brought out the shotgun. But the guy's doing some work with some Lancer, doing some big damage. These guys aren't moving up because of that uh, Lancer that he's using. Right now, I'm on board with Phobia. He's on mid-bridge, kind of just overseeing everything, watching this the uh, the top side right now on canals. Street looks pretty clear. Waldo, who are you on board with? Looks uh, like Torquebo was just picked up as well by uh, yeah. by Vex. Yeah, Dispensa has got for, got hit with it. I think he snuck out with it. He's gonna snake up the mid bridge. They're gonna try to play on bridge. We're talking about map control here. Vex is in control. They've locked off Justice to pretty much one side of the bridge. They're gonna start lobbing Torquebo. Didn't connect. Good shots over there. They're just gonna try to create pressure. Boyd's caught out of position. Gets torqued. Oh, and he gets a double kill. Great job by Dispensa there. Icy gets the headshot. And then Vex is taking another round. 3-2 to Vex. And that's the problem when you start losing map control and you start getting pinched. Yeah. You there it's only a matter of time. And in this game, you should never lose a 3v1. You just shouldn't. Even on a 3v3 with that many power weapons, you have to like try to draw out as many weapons as you can. Uh, we're gonna hop on camera. Uh, Mortal looks like he's gonna be playing up on snipe. Don't know if it looks like he is gonna pick it up, slides it, gets it picked up. Gonna look across the map, try to get the shots. Puts pressure on the other sniper. Looks like Toy Soldier's gonna take out Cubano. Kobe is gonna take out. Oh my gosh, Toy Soldier and them just absolutely barrage the middle bridge. And it looks like it's a 4v1 versus Mortal. And there's only so much he can do here. He doesn't have a Lancer. He's got his long shot. He needs to hit headshots and then he needs to run. He needs to try to split the team. I see not paying attention. Ooh, missed the shot. Nice try by him. Immortal's in a bad spot. He's going to get pinched. There should be Lancer Cross coming out. Dispense is doing a great job. Dropping Immortal. And Vex goes up 2-0. Vex right now. Overall count 2-0. Looking very, very solid. Uh, you, know, our, you know, my prediction looking pretty nice. I don't know about yours. Uh, but uh, either way, guys, if you're just tuning into the stream, thank you so much. Uh, say what's up right now. Vex leading the way 2-0. But we got some maps lined up on Gears of War here tonight. Next map coming up, Old Bones. Looks like Justice is going to be the ones taking over the hosting. So we're going to probably want a quick commercial break here. But I'd like to get uh, your overall thoughts, Waldo, on those first two maps. I mean, what'd you think? I, I think they were great. I think they played out pretty much how I figured they were. Uh, those maps are really in favor of, you know, uh, Vex's play style. They're very aggressive.